They say when you're surrounded by infinity, make any wish and it will come true. So I'm going to find some infinity. Thank you, without this you cannot know what would happen. Why, why does this feel familiar? It's just a constant stream of Inferium coming into this chest now. I need netherite. There's someone up here. Mr. Timothy. Hello, Mr. Timothy. Oh. This appears to be a basement. Are you friendly, Mr. Timothy? You don't look friendly, Mr. Timothy. You look like some sort of... Yep. Yep, you are very not friendly, Mr. Timothy. I would go so far as to say, fuck you, Mr. Timothy. Oh, would you look at that? You're on fire. How terrible for you, Mr. Timothy. Ow! Stop poisoning me, Mr. Timothy. Come closer. Yes, come closer, Mr. Timothy. Screw you. And Mr. Timothy died. And I have run out of torches. Uh, but there is lots of loot here. So this wasn't what was clawing at me? Well, there is a lot of loot here. And there is coal. And I made the sensible decision of bringing some wood along with me. Because I thought, yep, yeah, you know what? I may need some torches on the fly. There we go. So this is what, like a little a little dungeon area for Mr. Timothy? Mr. Timothy got himself in prison, did he? I can see why he was a dick. Timothy's windswept short bow of dexterity, gain speed on an arrow hit. Poison tip, quick draw power 3. Well, that's nasty, isn't it? I also do not even slightly have the capacity to carry this stuff. Uh, where am I? <laughs> Underground. Great. That's helpful. Thank you, map. I wish I had more torches. Because it's quite dark digging just a straight path up from this bloody Timothy dungeon. I assume there will be an end if I just keep going up. Like I'm, I've gone really far and I can I can barely tell where I'm going. Just up, roughly. Oh! Okay. I'm in the underground. Somewhere. Ah! Ooh. Oh hell. Oh yeah, the scanner says there are a lot following me. Oh no. I just need to lose them. Oh, water. And outside. Oh wow, I'm here! Oh, I'm not alone. So Timothy's dungeon, Miss, sorry, Mr. Timothy's dungeon, oh okay, yeah, he's a tough one. Mr. Timothy's dungeon is like just below here. Okay. Uh, this way? No, I'm one over. So I'll go the long way. There it is. Yay. Ah, uh, I like how that's all lit up now that I've sort of claimed it. And how that one's being lit up as well. Oh, and I can see my friends. Strange how much safer and happier I feel when I'm inside this, you know, this particular ruined building compared to the other ruined buildings. Oh. My socketed um, helmet broke. Do I have another helmet? I've got plenty of other helmets. Uh, one with an empty socket. Is that the best one I've got with a socket? Yeah, the rest aren't doing particularly well. Uh, okay. 
So, uh, when attacked, gain resistance, fall damage reduced, uh, plus two armor, toughness, health, and speed. Plus four cold damage, that's interesting. Total attack damage, armor piercing, plus one reach could be cool. But I think I'm going to go with the lifesteal. Uh, and I need the uh, smithing table, I believe. Okay. And so... Ooh, I feel a bit quicker. I think I'm going to have to move those sheep because... Ah, uh, I can't. I can't take that. I can't take that every time I go to collect the stuff. Because I'm going to... How did one get out? Okay, well... No more hidden? No. Okay. Uh, I think... I will repurpose this building because I'm not really using it, it's a ruined one. Um, I should finish claiming this one as well. Oh, yeah, the sensation's fading in this building. Oh, that's a weird looking slime. And uh, yep, yeah, two witches. So that's me done for now. I should go find that last prosperity shard I need. I wonder if the um, the crop tools, I don't know how good they are. I wonder if one of those is capable of netherite level mining. I love the way zinc looks. Just something about the sort of turquoisey colour of it is very appealing to me. How deep does this slate go? I feel like I've been digging through it for ages now. Ah, oh, diamond. Not that I'm particularly short on diamond, I've got absolutely tons of it from all the boxes. Dark stone. Oh! Lava and bedrock. Hmm. Is this the bottom? Okay, yep. Yeah. Should have seen that coming. Is this the bottom of the world? I've always wondered, at least as long as I can remember, I've, I've wondered about the finite nature of the world. Is the world infinite? I mean, I've, I've never seen an end to this city, but is that because I haven't explored far enough, or is it because one doesn't exist? I don't know. But it makes me wonder, if the world is finite, is creating infinity possible or is it is it a necessity is it like is infinity the the light to the shadow or the shadow to the light that's something that has to logically exist if finite things do exist or is it a logical impossibility that infinite is possible if things are finite just deep mining thoughts i guess Ooh. Okay, yeah, I'm finding loads of lava down here, but I haven't seen a single bit of bloody prosperity ore. So I don't know if I came down too deep or if I just missed it. It seems to be incredibly rare at the best of times, so I, I guess just digging blindly somewhere where I don't even know if it can be found is not the smart play. What I should do is I should return to somewhere where I know I've seen it and dig around at that level because I know it does form at that height. That's a smarter way to do this. And using this wood that I brought with me, I will do something sensible. Rather than going all the way back up to the bloody surface to drop off the masses of stone I have, I'm just going to leave them in a box here. Well, I messed that up, didn't I? There. Now I just hope that doesn't get blown up. I'm sure I saw some prosperity over here, but I, I don't recall exactly. I, I think I'm fairly sure I see. Oh, yeah, yeah, there was some because I remember like, oh, how did I miss that? And I like, walked right over it. And it was just over here somewhere. Yeah, I was here and I saw it there. So it forms at least at this level. So I guess I will dig at this level and we'll see what we find. This is the most, like, efficient way to strip mine, I think. 
you do a tunnel three by three with a gap of two between them. So, like, I know there is no prosperity or in this gap, but I don't need to mine it. And then I just keep going across like this using the torches as, um, as markers. Actually, if I go up and I just sort of cut through up here as well. And then that way uh, I'm covering a, the largest area I can uh, without needing to sort of double back or anything. Finding loads of ores, but none that I actually need right now. Bought ore. I'm not sure I've seen this one before. Bought? What is bought? It apparently is nothing. Very valuable. Yeah! Prosperity, finally! Okay, I'll just finish this row. And... Oh, some more, good. Finally found prosperity ore. It is shocking how... Yeah, it's deep, deep prosperity or shocking how rare this stuff is. Of course it's not. It's, it makes sense why this is so rare, because this is the vital component for the um, industrialized uh, material processing. So this is probably the most mined thing on the bloody planet. Because they did what I'm trying to do. Set up these material farms so that they don't need to go mining for the rest of this stuff. It is it's the base element from which all other things can be made, essentially. Yeah. Well, my... Uh, what's it called? Matic broke. Oh, well, I got what I needed anyway. Very nearly left without mining this. That would have been silly. But now, that is um, 11 prosperity shards, plus the three I've got. 14 is enough to make um, <laughs> 14 is enough to make the crystal and two seeds that is it so I definitely need to once I've got the crystal then I can start looking into these um, these essence tools and stuff and I can see how good they are and if I'm lucky one of them may be capable of um, of netherite level mining I look forward to the day when I don't have to manually mine. When I don't have to carry ch double chest loads of stuff up in two trips just because of all the stone I find. I mean, I'm already having to compress it into, um, uh, like, solidified blocks of deep slate and cobblestone just to, just to make sure I don't have to keep building new chests to store it in up here. I've got, like, uh, where is it here? Like compressed blocks and stuff and I'm gonna have to make another one now I think it was very smart building all of these oh yeah I've got all this stuff very smart building my tools out of stone with like modifier stuff on top of them because then they are just so easy and cheap to repair oh I forgot I had um <laughs> I forgot I had repair kits with me Welp. well now I've got a load more materials to process so uh, in batches of three I'll just start putting these through to uh, get those sorted and ingots. But now, one, two, three, four of those, and I believe I need a diamond. Oh! Rain, yes. Um. Yeah, what, what do I need for... Do, I might actually need eight for this. Yeah, I needed a prosperity gemstone. Wow, I'm very glad I found more. If I just found one and stopped then, I would be scuppered right now. But now I do have enough to produce the master infusion stone. At last. Hear that, Kathy? Master infusion stone. Yeah, I don't really know what it means either, but... Here we go. Prosperity gemstone and two supremium to produce a supremium gemstone. And then four of those, and four of those to produce the Master Infusion Stone with unlimited uses. Now I need to go change all of the... Alright, well I may as well use this one up first, and then swap it over. Because otherwise it's just going to sit there. So I should have enough here that it can just use it all. 
Yep, it broke. Good. Right, now I just need to go through and change all of the recipes to use the master. Like so, and then boom! Infinite! That is incredible. I'm already back up to, to Supremium. So what do I need? Let's have a look at this Supremium and see what I can actually do with it. Uh, processor, farmland, furnace... Uh, gemstone, insanium, ingot? Is that what I use to make the tools? Yes, it seems it is. Ah, but it looks like I do have to upgrade through the tiers. Supremium pickaxe tier 5, tier 4. Um, tier 3, 2, 1, and... So presumably tier 1 is still an upgrade on diamond. But this looks like something I can actually do. Um, it is going to cost a lot of prosperity, though. Uh, I suppose right now it's my only option. I have no idea how on earth I could get netherite. Um, oh yeah. All right. I'm gonna. I'm gonna have a think while I'm clearing out this um, this building. Hopefully. And then we'll, I'll just, I'll see what I think. Oh, what? There's a hole all the way through the building. I did not notice that before. Wow, okay. Sort of awkward not being able to feel temperature sometimes, because I, I just didn't realize I was wet. Although I suppose I did, and like I just assumed it was wet from walking through the rain and not sort of actively wet. I don't know. Sometimes astounds me how little sensation I have. Wow, this guy's a lot of health. Are they getting stronger? There we are. Clear and free. Which means I can now turn this into a barn, although I'll probably need to block up the other doors. Oh shit! Why did I do that? I didn't even think of what I was doing when I broke that. Well, guess I'll come back to that then. Oh no, unless I can lure her out. Hey! Hey, yeah! Come out here! Come, come out! Come out here. Oh no! Oh no, you you cleverly followed me. Ha. Now you're outside. Stay there. Hello. Uh Okay. Ow! Oh, you are... You are hostile. And very hard to kill. Come on. There we are. I'm fairly sure this building is bad. Is this building bad or there's a monster in there? Yeah, I'm fairly sure this building is bad, so I'm just going to seal that off. Uh, although I should loot this place. Oh, there's a skeleton in here. That was a weak one. Is this another ruined building, or is this just a... Uh... This could just be a crap building. It's taller than I thought. Seal it off at each level. I don't know that I've really looked at this one. How tall is it? it looks pretty tall. Uh, oh yeah, there's the, um, the ruined building roof. Uh, maybe three more floors. No, oh, that one's shorter. Oh, yeah, this one had a... Uh, whoa! Bloody hell. Yeah, this one had a question mark next to it. I wasn't actually sure. But that... That was an exploder. Maybe it was the exploders that did all this damage to to the these buildings, but some of the explosions seem much bigger than anything ex I've seen the exploders do. 
Like, that was a big explosion. But all it really did was take out a load of glass. Barely touched the stonework. So I'm inclined to think that's not what's been doing the damage. And in the box we have... Just a load of stuff, really. That one's not too tall either. Whoa! Yes, there's stuff in that building that really hates me. Is that... Was that above or below? I don't see it. It was above. There's the damage. And the roof. Oh, it is another ruined building. With a thing on top. Oh, wow. That's where it was? Alright, yeah, that, that did more damage. I mean, it's still not a massive one. Hang on! That's my bloody building! Did I not... F oh, I didn't finish lighting it up. Oh, okay. I well, guess I'll be going down through this one and making sure it's all lit up. Just to keep it safe from bloody exploders. But what's in here? Um, empty maps. Okay. Uh, wow. Huh. All right. That could be interesting. So starting at the top, I'm going to light up the big building. Seems I've already looted this place of, like, useful things or valuable things or the, the items and machines I usually find. So why did I not light it up? Did I just not have... Oh, bloody hell. Something exploded here. Hello. Do you like the building? It's mine, you know. Liberated it. Or just found it. This one might actually have been a decent one already. But claimed it, anyway. That's one advantage of the apocalypse, that no one's there to, to enforce property laws. <laughs> I just realised the, the horror of what I just said. No one's around to enforce property laws because everybody's dead. <sighs> oh! Oh god, I saw him way too late. Yeah, just blow more holes in my bloody building. Did I not search the basement? Because it looks very dark down here. It's possible I didn't. Oh, it opens up. Uh, no, I didn't. Uh, we have Wilden Wings, a Vortex Cannon. Hmm. Does this connect to anything I've been to? No, this is going in the opposite direction. So, like, ideally I want to break through from here to that tunnel over there. Actually, I, I believe I have my hammer. Although I'm getting very short on uh, torches now. There. Alright, well that's now connected that building to my other buildings. And it is this way, and then... God, this place is a bloody maze, I'm lost. Uh, yeah, here, here's my, my main building.